My name is Joseph McDaniel, and I'm an Arizona bankruptcy attorney. And since 2005, I also got to tell you that I'm a debt relief agency and that I help people and businesses file for bankruptcy. Today's topic is the top 10 boo-boos in a consumer Chapter 7 bankruptcy case. These are just some personal picks. There are more ways to goof up than these, of course. One is failure to list assets. Come on, people. It's a no-brainer. List all of your assets that have any value at all, and also the worthless ones. Number two, fail to appear at your 341 meeting, which is the first meeting of creditors. Three, fail to list creditors. Why are you doing all this? To get a discharge, right? So list creditors even if you don't want to because you plan to pay them. List them even if they're not dischargeable. List them even if it embarrasses you. You must list all your creditors. Four, another bankruptcy boo-boo is filing inside an insider preference period. If you repaid dad $100,000 on a legit debt 11 months ago, don't you think he'd appreciate it if you waited an extra 32 days or so to file? Just thinking. Number five, failing to show up with both your driver's license and your social security card at the first meeting of creditors. Number six, selling the $50,000 Corvette to your sister for a dollar the day before you file your consumer Chapter 7 bankruptcy petition in Arizona. It's called a fraudulent transfer, and it's really, really silly. Sorry for the judgmental attitude, but it is. Number seven, refusing to turn over your income tax refund to your Chapter 7 trustee. Number eight, failing to give the trustee the documents that he or she wants pursuant to the trustee letter you will receive right after you file. Number nine, filing a second or third consumer bankruptcy under a different name or social security number than the first one in an effort to fool creditors and the court. Terrible idea. Number 10, failing to take both the consumer credit education classes required under the 2005 bankruptcy amendments. Now, mind you, there are plenty of other ways to goof up. These are just 10 that jumped out and bit me when I thought about the topic. And, of course, nothing in the above constitutes legal advice. Find a good bankruptcy attorney for that. Thank you very much.